Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the new Taurus 856 snub nose revolver chambered in 38 special. When I first got this, I was a little overzealous. I took it to the range first. I really enjoyed it. It performed well in both double action, single action, plus P loads because it is plus P rated and, and those rounds were intense. Big muzzle flash, a little extra recoil, but it handled the plus P rounds just fine and I really did enjoy it. So I'm circling back around to the tabletop review and I'm calling this a closer look at this revolver. Now the greatest advantage here is that it comes with a cylinder that carries six rounds opposed to the long-standing Taurus 85 that holds five rounds. That's where the six comes from in the 856. It's, it's a copy of the Taurus 85 but they added a six for six rounds in the cylinder. And that, that is an advantage. Now, the MSRP on this, 388, you can pick it up right in the upper 200s, mainly like 270 is what I saw. And that's what it's available for. Now, there are many different color combinations. This one here is called Burned Orange. I, I call it red. <laughs> you know, it looks red to me. And that's what I wanted was red with the black accents all around and Taurus calls it burned orange so for all intents and purposes it is burned orange but I do like the black barrel ejector rod the crane the black cylinder and trigger and cylinder release spurred hammer and grip all in black I think it looks outstanding and when I did my range review I had mixed reviews about that some people loved the way it looks other people didn't but it's a good thing that Taurus makes many different combinations. And even black in a stainless look as well is, is also available. Check out that grip. It's got a little different texturing on the back strap. Nice grip. Little finger ledge there. The pinky grasps underneath that grip. I feel total control of the revolver. It also has this ledge here you can rest your thumb on when uh when gripping and then of course your weak side hand just kind of tucks over that keeping it out of the way of the cylinder gap but the the single action I already show clear here the single action the website says four to six pounds i'm measuring it at six pounds so it's definitely on the higher end of that the double action is fine single action right around six pounds and the one thing it does have is a transfer bar right there so the hammer strikes the transfer bar that then strikes the firing pin and that sets off that round and inside here what we're looking at is you know your firing pin up here your timing hand and your bolt lock right there so as the as the trigger is pulled you'll see that that bolt lock just kind of releases and the cylinder rotates counterclockwise with this revolver very nice setup it's a good looking setup it's got a ramped up front sight it you know could use some uh nail polish all right to pick it up better on the range because it is black if you have a, a black background it's going to kind of blend in so that would be a good way to go and a tunneled rear sight okay integrated into the frame I already mentioned spurred hammer you know, it's, it's, it's a nice looking revolver. I, I really appreciated the way it performed. Let's go ahead and get it on the scale. I think most people are gonna pocket carry these, especially these snub nose. You know, this is what I use to pocket carry my PM9. Every now and again, it would fit in that same pocket holster just fine. And it is light. Now, the, the website also says that it's weighing in at 16 ounces. I'm actually weighing it a little less than that, 15 and three quarters ounces. But I do have six rounds of 38 special, 130 grain, 38 special. We'll put them on there. Let's see, uh, see what the loaded weight is. And, uh, well, they're dropping, but that's not going to matter, is it? One pound, two and one half ounces. We move that to just ounces. It's weighing in at 18 and a half ounces. So that is why so many people pocket carry these snub nose revolvers and they do so with confidence they say you know what i'll take a revolver i don't have to worry about magazines i don't have to worry about jams and all that kind of stuff 
there are some maintenance that needs to be done with these but overall it's a more simple design and Taurus really mastered not just the looks but the function of these you know it, it's got everything that I think is important for a lightweight and it is an ultra light model snub nose revolver you know with a two inch barrel six pound single action trigger and then the double action is not bad it didn't take me long at all to figure it out when I was at the range I, I felt comfortable with it and I just felt confident that I could hit my target if needed here it is guys the new ultralight Taurus 856 snub nose revolver in 38 special if you like videos like this please subscribe and share I always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe.